Hey guys, here's another video for you. I'm actually out here right now on my father's property. Came back to go fishing. Before I start fishing, I figured I'd talk to you guys a little bit about my uh, 2014 Turex 4. Uh, it's 800cc, has the Fox racing shocks in the front. I've owned this for about a year and a half now. I absolutely love it. Been through hell. I don't baby the thing. As you can tell, it has a lot of scrapes, bruises. Even the uh, the dip on the front, as you can tell there, it's peeling off. It's only downfall with the camouflage that uh, doesn't last long. But uh, other than that, it's pretty good. And a couple of my lights are crooked from coming back here. It's a real tight trail to get back here with the side by side. Quite a foot, no problem. But a uh, couple of good features on this. I got my son's car seat in the back. One good thing about these is you take your kids with you. I got a cargo net out of a uh, 2015 Equinox. I'm using to keep the branches off my son. As you tell there, it's my cluster. It has uh, 2,379 miles. Just a steering wheel. You got your headlights, your mirrors, and rear view mirror. You also got your e brake down here. Hand grip for your passenger. You also have that one. That one's to help you get in. For the rear, they get this bar that goes across the back of the seats. I actually went and covered it with uh, PVC pipe insulation just so it has a little bit of extra padding so you don't crack your knee on the hard bar. And in the back window, my buddy actually found it in a uh, storage unit he won. He uh, was brand new. It's for Kawasaki Mule. I said I don't care as long as it keeps the dust from coming forward on me. I also have a uh, 2,500 pound Badland wench. I would not recommend one of these for one reason. It's the second one I've owned and it actually does not work right now. I have to go get another one, which I'm not going to buy another one of these. I'm actually going to go get a Warren. Um, I'm also, when I do the Warren, I'm gonna get the whole setup over at the dealership or I'm gonna get a snow plow and everything for this for the winter. But uh, other than that, it's a good running machine. My problem is the battery's dead every once in a while. My front tires are flat just because, I mean, as you can tell, my, my other room is actually worse than this one. It's bent. And the other one actually has big gouges taken out of it. But what do you expect? I mean, I beat the piss out of it. I don't mind that the tires fly just as long as it starts up and goes, even if I have to jump it. But it's a good running machine. I do recommend these if you guys are in the market for a, a four-seater side-by-side or even the two-seater Turexes. They're pretty good. If you guys uh, want any questions about mine or got any issues with yours, I work on mine constantly to get stuff fixed because it does break. Like I said, I beat the shit out of it, but it is a reliable machine. It will take a brunt. So if you guys have any... Uh, any questions, just comment below. Give me a big thumbs up if you like it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Later.